Area students are taking what they learn in the classroom and coming up with some very interesting experiments that are only being tested in the sky. Three, two, one, fire. In a matter of minutes, the UP Aerospace Space Loft XL rocket launched 72 miles in the air. It was really cool actually, just the way it went up and stuff. It was that's pretty awesome. That was really, really fun. I really enjoyed seeing something like that. It's like a one-time life experience. Several student experiments went into space as part of New Mexico's education launch to promote science, technology, mathematics, and engineering programs. We started learning about projects like rockets. We started doing rocket projects. And then we started getting really interesting and really familiar with it. And I was real great about it. That's what got me interested and that's why I came here. It was worth it. Travis DePoint and Ariana Damas are from Aztec High School. Their experiment focuses on electricity and if there's enough to generate during launch and flight to heat a New Mexico homegrown green chili. We heard about this thing called piezoelectricity and we thought it has to do with quartz crystals and stuff. So we thought that would be really cool to somehow tie that into an experiment to, to the rocket launch. Students look to see if piezoelectricity is a visible alternative power source that can be stored and then used in space instead of batteries. I learned uh, more about electricity and how to use circuit boards and rockets. We took apart cameras, toasters, microwaves, Every we took apart a whole bunch of stuff. The student launch helps promote and inspire lifelong learning. It's part of NASA's National Space Grant College and Fellowship Program. They have to have the pathway to space it's now open to them because of Spaceport America and because of this education program. Data captured on the 20-foot long rocket is being collected to determine which experiments work and what projects need a tweak. For KRWG, I'm Carlos Correa.